Good afternoon, I'm Sophie Jacobson with your local 10 News update. The Illawarra Shoalhaven region has recorded 23 new cases overnight. The majority are in Wollongong and so far nine have been linked. And there'll be a boost to the local policing numbers from Monday with 10 new cops starting in the Illawarra and South Coast region. They're part of 218 new recruits who have just graduated from the Goulburn Police Academy. And we're in for more disruptions to our railway network next week due to strike action. Heavily reduced services will be in place in the Illawarra and South Coast lines. Rail, trams and bus union members are refusing to man foreign-made trains as part of ongoing industrial disputes with the state government. And Shoalhaven City Council has installed an additional 445 solar panels as part of its effort to slash its corporate carbon emissions and reduce the running cost of its wastewater treatment plants. The solar panels are set to generate around 250,000 kilowatt hours of electricity per year and reduce greenhouse gas emissions while they're at it. Now taking a look at some local sport, the Allura Hawks are gearing up for their round one clash with the 36ers at Adelaide Entertainment Centre. It comes after a tumultuous pre-season for the Hawks, which saw two straight blitz cancelled due to a COVID scare. The Wollongong side say they were shifted their focus to making a winning start to their NBL 2022 campaign. To the weather now, partly cloudy and showers possible in Wollongong, 24 degrees. 23 the top in Dowra with a chance of thunderstorms sometime soon. 22 degrees the top in Batemans Bay. Further south, 21 degrees in Narooma.